once again welcome to Ayotech. I'm delighted to have you back on my channel. If you are new to this channel, consider subscribing and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming video. If you are old member of this channel, remember to like this video and share with friends. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create an awesome PowerPoint intro slide with just some few steps. So let's look at how this slide is going to play. So if I go to my slide, my slide and then I try playing this slide. Look at how this is going to show. So you can see how amazing this is going to display. So you can use this method to actually show or introduce new members to your team through presentation or introducing a new product. That is very unique way in which you can't at least woo your audience with this particular introduction step. And I'm going to show you everything step by step in order to know how to do this watch this video to the end and then you will learn every step so let's look at how we can do this so this is basically just three slides and i'm going to show you how to do this so let's start i'm going to open a new blank presentation so this is my new blank presentation so what i need to do is that i'm just going to type the first slide i'm going to type the title type the title So let's say this is the title of our presentation and the next slide we're going to add our members so let me just go to add new slide and on this page what i'm going to do is that i can just delete let me just delete this and then i'm going to say our new members so let me just center align this Control E will center align this, or you can just go to the paragraph option and then center align this. So once I'm done, I'm going to add the members on this page, and I'll show you how we can add that amazing transition. So I'm going to go to my insert tab, and then I'll pick what a text box. Okay, I'll pick a text box and then draw my text box over here. I'm going to add the members. So I'll go to insert and go to pictures. I have some few pictures I'm going to add. So I have some pictures on my desktop which I'm going to pick so I'll pick my first image this way and then I'll just resize it and then position it anywhere I want so I'm going to position this text over here and all I need to do is that I need three more I'll just copy and paste this so Control c will copy this and then I'll Control v to paste or you can just go, just go to home and then use the options available here to paste your images so control view paste so i have this over here once i click on this image i have the format option i can go there and then replace this so i'll just go to change image and i'll replace it with a different image so that's going to be a, the next team member from my list so i'll pick another image and then to change this i'll paste again and then i'll bring another member so i'll select this go to change and from file I'll select my image from my file because i already have this image on my pc so i'm going to select that image over here and then i'm going to add the last image i'll control v to paste again and then select this go back to change from file i'll select my image from file and i'll replace that one as well so basically we have all our members now the next thing we need to do now is to add our transition so with this with this slide selected with this slide selected we'll go to transition and there's one important you go to the drop down arrow wire so this should there's more slides or more transition and a particular transition we're going to use is called curtains so i'll click on this curtains and then i've applied this transition to this so you can see the preview of this transition but this does not really look nice let me go to my first slide and let's say let's go to slideshow and then let's start from from beginning let's play this slide from beginning and let's see how this is going to look okay already it's showing so amazing but it's not really what i want so let's see how we can manage this let's see how we can manage it i'm going to add another slide after this an empty slide so right click and then go to a new slide and i want it before this slide there our new member so I'll drag it on top and then it will not be the slide before my members okay so we have another slide before our members that is a slide we're going to add our curtains to 
So once we add those curtains, it's going to make our transition look more amazing. So let's look at how we can add that. So with this slide selected, I'll go to a set images and then you can download any curtain image from online and then you can use i've already downloaded some and then i'm going to use that i'll double click on it to select that let me just delete this title from here and then i'll just resize this i'll just resize it to cover this particular slide this way that's all i don't need any important or any unique way to do any resizing just leave it as it is so we have this slide before our main slide now where we have our members so now that we have this let's play our slide and see how this is going to look so from beginning so introducing new members so let's go and see so now when we play this slide let's see how this is going to display with a curtain as image so this so this is so amazing you can see how to introduce a new product you can use this to introduce a new product your company is having a new product you can use this method or even a new team member so this there's several ways to introduce yourself in a presentation and you can use this to do that and i believe this short tutorial is going to help you a lot in your presentation i'm going to have much for watching this short tutorial remember to like this video and then subscribe if you are new to this channel till i come your way another time remember to always visit my channel and share my videos with friends bye bye